Oh yeah, that would actually help. Because it would be pissing off the Lithuanian People's Republic, which is precisely what we want. And I think that's actually faster, because that only takes like... Uh, is that 40 days or so for one of the national focuses? So we might I actually... See, uh... We might be able to go to war with them, you know, without actually having the allies interfere with us. Because fuck the allies. Fuck the allies. Okay. Otherwise we will just have the same shit we had with... Uh, you know, beforehand. Do 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 do. Now then, I guess it would be a good time to actually if, let's speed up to three again, so we have some forward movement. I mean, I will take uh, this one. You will take mem mem mem. Uh, then you know, I will kindly just take. That's fair for some time. Yeah, we got a split. So basically, the area that is interesting for me, historically speaking, is Memel. And um, everything else that is, you know, has names that I can't say anyway, you can basically have. What's that? Uk merch. Uh, what the fuck is that supposed to be even? Uh, view Comezo? Yeah, something like that. See, si, see. Si. All the places where people speak languages that cannot be pronounced with the human tongue normally, you can have those places. I don't even want to say it. It's going to break my tongue. Okay, I will... Wait, uh... Which also means that if we at any point in the future go to war with the uh, Soviets, you can have lots of lands from them because, well, there are many names I can't even be asked. I, I would actually know, uh, really like you know, Kyiv. Now let's see. Um... Uh, or, uh... Let's see. Oh, really? Ilke Wookie, or it's really nice. They are probably getting stroke right now. That could very well be. Uh, oh, I can invite somebody to our faction. Well, shit, I kinda made a mistake, there, didn't I? Oh, yes, I did. Let me very, very carefully check this out. I think you might get me in war with Soviets. I think I just declared war on the uh, Soviet Union. Quite literally. You're a fucking evil, aren't you? How are you? I'm fucking... Wait. I'm pretty Wait. damn sure that we just declared war on them because I was like, oh, somebody wants to join our faction. I'm pretty sure they are at war with the uh, Soviets. Uh, I don't... Uh, for great good, I don't have war with them. We are at war uh, indeed with only the Soviet, the Union of Soviet Republics. So, um, so do you have some troops stationed on the border and prepared for an invasion? Because this would be a very good moment to surprise me and be like, yes, I have seen this coming 20 years ago. Uh, no, kindly actually prepare for an uh, I mean, Lithuania. Um, I think we have other things to worry uh, about. Right about now. Do you know what problem we have? Uh, big as Russia. Yes. Get your troops there and start preparing for an invasion because we need to deal with them quickly. If they manage to get their troops into position, we are fucked. We can do this, mind you. As long as nobody else joins from the common channel, the rest will join. I can tell you as much. Chego. No. Let's move to the Ural Mountains. This army. Let's move with the other army. Right. Moving up again. Okay, so I think we might uh, get fucked. Uh, yes. Have you prepared your plans? Tell me when you're ready, then uh, we're going to. 
hit the button and see what happens. That's, that's gonna be fun. Uh, from now I'm preparing my forces. Well, tell Anything. Tell me when you have your plans set up because this is going to be fun. Right. Well, fun is a nice way of saying it. <laughs> and from now on, I'm actually preparing where to hold my land la line when we actually uh, could. Okay, I'm, I am prepared. Okay, I'm going to. Um, uh, does my soldiers need to go on front line? I'm going to make it a bit faster again, so we actually can see our soldiers move to position, and then we're going to go for gold. Also, if you can have it, don't use the. Uh, for now, man, oh, sure. is holding up, so... Yeah, that means most of the Russian forces are going to move there first, but that's not going to take long. Let's just say. For a second, I need to set up that and um, call to arms request from King of Romania. King of Romania wants our help in their war efforts against the enemies. Huh? Sure, we don't really have an option here. And well, actually, we... I am the only one that uh, Russia doesn't have war with. Well, then you should probably join your allies because we are at war. Then, then, then call me uh, to war. I can probably do this, but for the moment, give me a second while I pull my planes forward. Do you have something that is big enough to keep all of my planes? Uh, uh, even Warsaw is too small. That's kind of annoying. Now, Poland. Call to arms. Soviet-German war. Send. Oh, then join me. Okay. And I'm going to pull those bastards. Now I'm going to call Italy into war as well. Everyone, fight against the monster that is, well, Soviets. Now, I will leave one of my armies sitting behind a bit to, you know, keep an eye on the French. We have seen what sort of asshole they can be. So, um... Uh, they just called Communist China. Yeah, I was kind of expecting Communist China to get around. And I'm pushing, I guess. Uh, could you, you know, uh, make the game alphabet faster? I can. Um, how about planes? How does it look for planes for you? Uh, I have not much planes, but I will try my best. I'm sending all of my planes into Poland, so... Uh, filling up your little airbases a bit, you know. Ah, oh, shit. This is going to be fun. It will be fun. Uh, it will be fun. Yes. I'm actually pushing, you know, like... Yeah, because they don't have any troops there yet. That's not really a problem. They're going to call slowly but surely everyone into the war. But then everything is going to get horrible. Believe me, I've seen this happening quite a few times at this point. Um, Let's see. If I send my... It's like not, not that huge. Uh, I see there is... Uh, air bears near Minsk, so... You fly to Königsberg, you will naval strike the Baltic Lower Baltic Sea to be precise and Okay, now then we are pushing into them, which is good. I have set the goal at the Ural Mountains for the moment. So I'm gonna push uh, all the way until there. Uh, I've set my uh, goal to Dnieper River. Because I'm not sure that we can actually make it to uh, to you know to Ural as Fast. That shouldn't really be a problem because the enemy troops are, you know, on the other side for the moment. We need to actually make use of this moment to really, really push them hard. Otherwise, uh, well, you're gonna see. The Soviets are a pain. Let's just say. Uh, I'm not actually well, China has been uh, <laughs> joining us. We call them to arms too. 
Everyone hates the Soviets this time. I like it. I love it. We might actually have a good bit of a problem here. Get another assuming leadership. China. Well, China, you will not take leadership of the Axis from me, mind you. Okay, progress is being made. Poland is actually growing because of that, because, well, since I'm coming from your country, I'm taking it basically over in your name at the moment. My great army is actually, actually pushing a lot. I hope they are, because we really, really, really need that. We fucking need to be very fast here. Basically, it's all decided in the first few months. If the Soviets actually manage to get their troops back here, and you know, keep us... They are getting slowly and truly, but I see there are so... There's more and more Soviets there. Yeah, we need to push most aggressively. Right. Yeah, I will try to take an airport in uh, Minsk. We have one which holds uh, a lot of planes, I mean. A lot. Well, yeah. And sure, also my planes. Where are my planes actually sitting? My planes are right now sitting at Novogrodek or whatever the fuck that is supposed to be. You know. Yeah. I'm going to pull them forward as soon as we capture a nice big airbase. Because, you know. Kinda need that. You stay here, you bloody fucking. Das Küstengeschwader. Well then, um, where do we need some help? In the south we need actually a lot of help. Okay. Once we make sure that up there are no actual uh, groups, we shall... Uh, Probably send back most of our units. Yes, move in. Capture it, please. France joined the Allies. How surprising. Just, you know, not really. Come back. John, you're dropping out there. Whoop, gone he was. Uh, okay, what's... Okay. Something bad happened. Yeah, it would be. I have a little bit of lags because... Need to help in the war for enemies. Uh, Yugoslavia. Uh. Oh, look at that! We can invite Japan to our uh, action. They are at war with nobody. Yeah. Join me. Now then. Uh, I guess we can continue with our basic tactic for the moment. I will send one unit. No, let's actually make this two units. Up to the north to deal with that. I'm going to have big ass lags like. Okay. So we German war two. Wait a second, I see something very disturbing. Why are we at war with the Allies? What? I'm not... I am not at war with the Allies, only Italians. Okay, Japan is at war with everybody. That explains it. Am I at war with everybody? Yes, I'm at war with everybody. That's going to fuck me over, isn't it? Uh, mm. I'm only at war with Russia, so... A bit of blood. <laughs> I 
I'm going to call all of my allies into the war now. And Yugoslavia, of course, is immediately attacking. That's great. Mm. And apparently, according to the game, you're 29 hours behind. That is not good. Probably could have avoided it, couldn't we? continues though, I'm kind of having to pull some of my war effort back to the home front. Mostly because I was going to get fucked. And I'm ending... Oh, I see where... Oh, I see where this should go. Czechoslovakia uh, declared war on us. Uh, Yugoslavia first. Basically, Italy declared war on Yugoslavia. Yugoslavia can't have declared war. And now we are yeah. in a world war. We are fucked a lot, like. A lot, a lot, a lot. Well, yes. That is uh, a very astute statement, because now our rear side is going to get some friendly attention from the Allies. And I'm currently having a stroke, like, a lot right now. And apparently I'm demanding um, Slovakia. Well, no, it was so fast, but still, you know. Um, and I think that I might... I might... Um, oh my god, I saw the biggest lag, like, ah, uh, I can't do anything. Uh, can't that's, even... that's a pain, yeah. Like, I can't actually do anything. I'm in biggest city right now. Yeah, according to the game, you're still 24 hours behind, so a whole day behind. Ah, lag is a pain. Wait, I'm not to how I start to have Give me seconds. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, this game is pain in the ass. Well, the problem is now it's like, hmm, do we want the Polish National Republic to become AI controlled? Not really 